My name is Karen Alexander Hoschel, and I am a direct descendant of one of the pioneering families that arrived here in 1858. They arrived aboard a steamship, Oregon, and they came at the request of Governor James Douglas, who needed more settlers in this area so that this area would not be annexed to the United States when the 49th parallel went through. They actually had a very good life. Uh, they were all invited here, so people were quite welcoming. Uh, Charles was a carpenter, but he also had a farm, and they farmed there for about 30 years before they moved into town and moved into closer quarters. Charles and Nancy produced a total of 12 children, so there wasn't too much out of the farm mode because they had to look after the farm, they had to look after the children, he was doing carpenter work, they were quite busy. Their involvement with the church was uh, Charles and Nancy built this church. Nancy did most of the feeding of the crew that was helping to work on it, but Charles actually designed and built the church that we are in right now. And this church was originally called South Saanich. It was then changed to Shady Creek United Church and has recently been changed to Central Saanich United Church because that's the community that it's in. I think my family's story is important because number one, they are black people and I am a descendant of them. But it's also important that people know that you can get along with all different races and it was very important that they came and settled here because they were invited and their family legacy goes on and on through the next generations. This dress that you're looking at now was Nancy Alexander's a wedding anniversary dress from 1909 for her 60th wedding anniversary. Uh, one question I asked when I saw the dress was, why is it black if it's for an anniversary? And was told that most ladies only wore black and they accessorized it with different colors for different functions. So if it was a wedding, it might be the wet, white underneath. If it was a funeral, she'd wear black blouse underneath. If it was another occasion, she might wear red or blue or green blouse underneath. So it was accented by what was the blouse was.